All right, I'm here with junior quarterback for the Xyra EHK Spartans, Bryce Brabham. Big game tonight, Bryce. You guys put up some points and some run yards. I had you unofficially for over 200 yards and six touchdowns. So let's talk about your big game tonight. I'd like to thank my linemen. If it wasn't for Alex Hansen, Cannon Hansen lead blocking for me, I honestly would not be there doing it. Um, we've been practicing all week, having the lead blockers, and they really, they really put it down tonight and put us where we needed to be. So you guys have made a couple adjustments on the offensive side as the year has gone on. Uh, what's that? What are those adjustments been made, then, and how are they working for you guys? They're working well. We're trying to get to the outside, use the speed that some of us have, and uh, you know, just get outside and cut up the holes. Uh, when it came to your guys' defense as well, you kind of big up big time in the second half. You had a big tackle there I don't, on, on uh, Godfrey late where you grabbed his arm. Otherwise, it would have been Godfrey to the house. So kind of give us a nod on your defensive effort tonight. Uh, yeah, I just I just tried my best. And when I missed that tackle, I knew I had to grab his arm or else he was gone. He was toasting me. So that's about it, yeah. And then uh, when your coaches are hammering down uh, the way you guys want to approach things defensively, what do they kind of preach to you guys? They just preach that we got to keep our mindset straight and not to talk anything and just keep it straight and and play some football. You guys move on to two and two. You'll be moving on to Cam next week. Yes, I'm not saying wins or losses here, Bryce, but what are your just you know expectations for the Spartans heading forward? Hey, play football like Spartans can. That's what my expectation. All right, that's an excellent answer. Bryce Brabham, six touchdowns, big night tonight on the quarterback side of things and defensively. Hey, good job tonight, Bryce, and good luck the rest of the way. Thanks, All right, I'm here with head coach Drew Buckholt of the Xyra EHK Spartans. Hey, Coach, you guys come away with a big 46-28 to 28 point lead. Uh, go ahead and uh, give a comment on what it was like for your players tonight. Oh, it was fun. It was exciting. It was homecoming, so the kids were a little excited. Uh, we broke out, broke out the black-on-black -black uniforms, and that got the kids going. And uh, I just told the team, you know, after last week's uh, loss, you know, we were going to find out what type of competitors we were this week, and I think we found that out tonight. Yeah, I mean, what are you going to say to your kids on that? You know, big, you know, not a very frustrating week last week. And like you said, the best case scenario is to bounce back hard, and they did so. So what are some comments you're going to give to them? Well, I mean, I just, it shows what type of competitors they are. You know, they're never going to hang their head. They're always going to get back to work, get on the bicycle again and drive. And uh, that's just, that's been our message all year is consistency. And we're going to improve after this week. You know, that's what every coach says, and that's what every team should do. We're playing better ball and just hopefully we can continue that. So in that first half is a back and forth affair, you know, kind of back and forth on touchdowns, trading off touchdowns. Um, when you guys were going into halftime, what were you preaching to your kids? Oh, just eliminate the big play. Uh, we gave up too many big plays on defense. Uh, gave up one right after, right in the end of the first half. And, uh, you know, just preaching, cleaning that up. And I thought we were giving them too much time. So we uh, made an adjustment out of that formation, brought some pressure, didn't give them much time. and. Uh, and then just executing on offense, too many penalties still. I got to cut those down. Uh, they cut a few drives short, so cleaning that kind of stuff up. Offensively tonight, you guys had a big success in the run game. Uh, I got them unofficial, but you guys had like 280 yards rushing, 200 on Br Bryce Brabham. So go ahead and give a, just a comment on how you did tonight. Oh, Bryce ran the ball hard. Uh, Bryce and Alex are kind of our two-headed monster. Um, they both run extremely hard. Uh, we incorporated more motion into our offense to, you know, change the defense's eyes. Uh, and it turned out uh, great tonight. We also made a change. At, uh, we put Cannon Hanson at left guard. Uh, and I thought the communication up front was great. Not too many missed blocked assignments. And, you know, as a result, we rushed for 280 yards. Can't complain there. Um, you guys move on to two and two. Those first three games, you know, I could say, you know, sort of frustrating for you guys. And I've heard coaches say before, there's always one game in a season that really pivots your, your season in the direction it's going to go. Uh, just give a comment on how it's possible that game like this tonight might be the right thing for you guys. Yeah, as you said, there's, you know, turning points in a game, and I think this is it. Uh, we kind of clicked on all cylinders tonight, and uh, we're just going to continue to get to work. Um, uh, and yeah, stay consistent. Not wins or losses, coach, but what are things looking forward for the Spartans here the rest of the season? No, just looking forward to our kids growing and learning. Uh, we're still just going to continue to get better. And, you know, we'll let the chips fall where they may. All right. Nonetheless, you guys are walking away with a win. Good night, win, coach, and good luck the rest of the season. Thank you.